Hey guys, it's Abe, and today I'm here at California's Great America for Worldwide Coaster Kids Day. And I don't know about you, but I think we have a pretty good turnout. Oh wait, never mind, they're over here. So we all just rode Railblazer, and what do you guys think? Alright, yeah, it was pretty awesome. I love this as always. I, I'd give it a, a 4.75 screams. It's awesome. The only thing that takes away from it is it's a pretty short ride. So what do you guys think? Um, I'm going to rate it a 4.75 also. Um, my name is Patrick, and I'm from Sacramento. My name is Cameron. I'm from Sacramento, and I'll rate it four, I mean five screams. Um, I'm Gavin, I'm from Sacramento, and uh, I rate it five stars. I'm Matthew, I'm from Sacramento, and I would give that right a five. I'm Juvenal, and I'm from San Mateo County, and I'll give this a five. I'm Nick, I'm from San Jose, and I give it a 4.75. Hi, my name's Louisville, I'm from Mountain View, California, and I'd give this a five screams. My name is Austin Cloud, I'm from Campbell, California, I give this a five screams, awesome ride. I'm Logan, I'm from Atwater, California, and I rate this about a four screams. I'm Charlie, I'm from Belmont, California, and I rate it five screams. I'm Darius, I'm from the Bay Area, and I rate this roller coaster a five. All right, so we just rode the Demon, and it's pretty fun. I'd probably give it three screams. It's a little bit rough, but that doesn't really take away from the ride. It just doesn't really do much, but there are some forceful moments. What do you guys think? Hey, I'm Jacob, and I. it's an interesting aero, co uh, aero coaster. I, I think it's a two-screen ride. I'll give it a 1.5. I'll give it a one. I'll give it a three. I'll be nice. Um, 3.5. I would give it a 2.5. My elbows are hurting. Oh, I give it an easy 4.5. My elbows. Three. Two headaches. Uh, 2.5. I didn't get whiplash on it this time, so. Just got off of Psycho Mouse, and even though it's a family coaster, it's pretty good for what it is. Uh, it's intended for, you know, the younger audience. But it's pretty good Wild Mouse. I probably give it 2.75 screams. Uh, I give it a two. Well, I give it a three screams. Three. 1.5. I'll give it a three. I get a three. I actually really like it. Oh. Yeah, it's three. I get a three. I give it a 2.5. Ah. I give it about a three. I give it a 2.75. I give it a two and a half. Um, three. So here with Juvenile, and he's about to do his Be Brave Challenge on Drop Tower. So are you excited? Yeah, I'm excited for a little nervous. All right, yeah. let's go. Let's go. Are you a waffle? Or are you a pancake? and this was your Be Brave Challenge, yep. so what did you think about it? You know, it's not as bad as I thought it was. I thought it was fun. I give it a five. Yeah, I love drop towers. They're fun. This one's really fun. I'd probably give it a four screams. Want to go right side now? Uh, yeah. All right, let's go.
服。So we just got off of Rapids and as you can tell we're all pretty soaked but it's fun and we're gonna go dry off on Flying Eagles but what do you guys think? Just scream out your rating on one, two, three, four million screams! 100 splashes. Let's go ride Flying Eagles. Yeah. Alright so this is Gavin's first time he's about to ride flight deck and as you can see he's just tall enough so are you excited? Yeah. Alright you want to go ride? Yeah. Alright let's go. So Gavin and I just got off a of flight deck and it was your first time riding. Did you like it? Yeah. Uh, what, what would you rate it? A four. I would probably give it a four too. It's definitely pretty short, but there are some intense moments where maybe even gray out. So what do you guys think? I like it. It was like smooth and intense, but it was pretty short, so I give it a four. Uh, four screams for me. I give it a 4.5. Really love this ride. Um, I really like this ride. I'd probably rate it 4.25. Really intense, it's a nice intro. I'll give it a four. Very fun ride, I give it a four point five. Yeah, it's really fun. I would give it um a three point seventy five. Um, I like this invert, it's pretty good for what it is. Um four point five. It slaps, I give it a five. <laughs> um pretty good. I'd say it's probably about a four point five. I'll give it a four point five. Alright, ready to ride Grizzly? Yeah! yeah. Alright, so we're about to ride Woodstock Express and are you guys excited? And we do not want anybody's eyeballs smelting now. <laughs> Later that same evening. We all just had an awesome ride on Gold Striker, and as you can tell, my voice is absolutely gone, but that's just because of how much fun I'm having. And I always have fun on this roller coaster. It's definitely a bit rickety, but for me, it doesn't take away from the experience too much. I'd probably give it a 4.75 screams. It's a great ride, a bit rough, so I'll give it a 4.5. A three. It was um, running, it's not running very well today. I would give it a 4.5. Um, I love this ride, however, I kept it about 0.5 points because of the roughness, it's 4.5. My thing with this ride is, it opened on my birthday in June 1st, I have an emotional attachment, but I give us a 5, it's rough, but it adds to the ride completely, it's awesome. Um, I've had better days on this coaster, it was kind of running a bit um, sluggish for today, but um, 3.5. Um, I would rate it in a 4.5 because it's pretty good, the air time is really good, it's intense and it may be a little rough, but I don't mind it, it's still a really good ride. Yeah, it's getting rough for four screams. Uh, that was one of my worst rides on Gold Striker. Um, I got stapled halfway through the ride, but it was still an enjoyable ride, uh, 4.25. So that wraps up the first ever Worldwide Coaster Kids Day here at California's Great America. And I think it was a huge success. We had a pretty big turnout. We rode some awesome roller coasters. And did you guys have fun? Yeah! yeah! As always, make sure to be great and ride on!
Worldwide Coaster Kids Day. It's a little late. <laughs>